National Food Information Council's annual uh, food and health survey, 36% of Americans have reported following a certain diet type or eating pattern that is specific to them. That means that one in three people around you in your everyday life have made a choice, a lifestyle choice, to improve their mental, physical, emotional, and spiritual health by changing what goes into their body. And yet, it's not an easy task. Even in this day and age where we have an overabundance of diet books and perhaps too many websites for a certain diet or another diet, it's not exactly easy to follow through on a certain lifestyle choice that one makes. We strive to make that as easy as possible, to make maintaining your lifestyle as easy as possible. We empower you to choose. So the problems that a lot of people encounter regarding following a new diet or following a diet in general is they don't always know what fits within the bounds of their dietary parameters. What exactly is or is not vegan or what would count as a paleo meal and what would be beyond that, right? And then there's also the question of, if I'm following this diet, am I getting enough of the daily nutrients that I need? As someone who's vegetarian, am I getting enough calcium intake? Am I getting enough um, protein intake? Am I getting the right balance of nutri nutrition that I need for my daily life cycle as a person, even outside of my dietary restrictions? And then of course, there's the time. Sometimes it takes so long trying to find a good recipe to fi fit your diet type that's quick and easy to make that it really defeats the point of finding something that's quick and easy to make because finding it was hard enough. So what we strive to do is make a one-stop shop. We want to provide a solution that will make choosing what you eat as easy as possible. We do this in um, by having a mobile application on your mobile device. It uses the camera on your phone. You don't have to get anything else. You scan whatever ingredients you have in front of you and it'll show with an AR tag what nutrition information you see. So for example, with this potato, you can see that you just have your phone hover over the potato and this will show up showing that this has this many calories. And then if you wanna click on the nutrition information, Further, you can see the breakdown of the macronutrients and things like sodium and whatnot, so that you can have a better source of information about what you're putting into your body. Another thing is that this will automatically um, go red. This uh, AR tag will go red if something is outside of the bounds of your diet or if it is exceeding your nutritional intake for a certain thing within your um, daily parameters as well. And then of course, there's the recipes button, which takes all of the things that you have hovered over and scanned, and based on the things that you've scanned, it provides you with a quick recipe that fits whatever diet preference that you've chosen in the settings. We also want this to be a community building uh, platform because according to Forbes, the diet trends or the food trends of the future in the market, they're going towards technology and they're also heavily based on tribes. So a certain, um, a certain tribe would be like, these people are vegan or what have you. So we would like to have an open source um, platform for people to be able to share the recipes that they like the most and have others be able to choose what they would like to eat accordingly. Now, this will save our end users effort in trying to look for recipes and finding the right ingredients and whatnot. It'll save them um, time in doing so. And as far as informing them with uh, the nutritional information of everything that they're putting into the body, it will also improve their overall health. <clears throat> so we strive to um, impact the market initially of about 6 million people. This is just the initial market of the United States, Canada, and Great Britain, and only the vegan preference to begin with for our testing phase. This market potential has um, a profit of about 
30 million dollars just to begin with and that is before we begin the global expansion and expand our scope to increase our um, diet preference options to have like paleo keto um, and like dash other diet preferences that someone might want phase one of our release will be just on the app store so that will be the five dollars for each download and it will be of course global but it will be focused the marketing will be focused towards the um, uh, market in the United States, Great Britain, and Canada. And then phase two, we're hoping to partner with our um, food providers such as Whole Foods or um, grocers or even things like Blue Apron. So the testing phase, we're planning on getting the word of mouth to and the app store downloads as well as social media influencers to really spread the influence. Phase one will be when we actually launch for the full market. And that we're going to be looking for dietitians, nutritionists, and wellness clinics to kind of tell their cus 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 customers about our products. And then phase two will be when we finally partner with our um, food providers. So our team is made up of five students from the University of Houston who are computer science majors, and we're devoted in making a change in this world to improve the holistic health of the world to come. So the next steps are launching on the Google Play Store um, and including the social media integration so that you can share your recipes with anyone you want on any platform that you want and then launching on the App Store after that. We're going to be, in phase one, we're going to be increasing the diet options and expanding the, the recipe database. And then in phase three, we're gonna create the food marketplace, which is connecting consumers to where they would be getting their uh, actual foods, actual um, farm to market, people or um, sprouts or whichever um, food provider they would be choosing. So for um, our first phase, we want testers and influencers. So we want people who can spread the word as well as people who would be able to test the app and um, let us know about what kind of uh, changes we can make and how we can improve our recipe database. And then for phase one, we want the nutritionists and dietitians to make sure that the um, parameters that we have are correct, as well as um, for phase three, for phase two, we would want our um, corporate partners to um, connect with us and provide a marketplace for their own products. Thank you very much. Um, we're Diet AR, and we hope to finally make it so that your goals for eating right are within sight.